Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting bringing to episode three of Sunshine in the Mirrors. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. <laughs> it is still cold, yay! Oh my god. Right. <laughs> but don't be me, Yolani. Yes. Mm hmm Yeah. Mm hmm Oh my god. More like little, but okay. Right? And you said sis. Excuse me. So if this is stage one for the animals here, what the heck is stage two or three? Or is there a stage three for this? Because if there's a stage one, there's got to be a stage two and there's automatically got to be a stage three. What is it though? But of course, we're not going to say it until later on. Mm hmm. Not the thing from freaking Legend of Zelda. The babies get acknowledged, like, yes, go, Ruby, go. Oh, the bad about a random motorcycle? Go ahead. Go ahead, babe. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's go. Yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> Just con isekai mech with this. What, what is this show? Uh, it's okay. I love it. Mm 
Johanna, do something! Daya literally just said, yeah, you know what? Even though Yoshiko is your number one, I am still your number one as well. Like, oh, she was like, I am back in the running of best girl. I will always be your best girl. Like, the heel oh my god <laughs> yeah. Th this is no time to argue oh my god Yeah, just chat. So now all, are all three of them going to sing today? I ain't mad at it. I mean, we could do four with Ruby. Okay, no, never mind.
that's a Mission Impossible type ish diet, but you know what? It's okay. A 10 out of 10, babe. Now, did Johanne just get the symbols representing Daya, Ruby, and Chica? Big Mom is just giving me Charlie's vibes. <laughs> Charlie's angels! Except we get to see her face. Yeah, exactly. That's what it is. <clears throat> you mean Mari? The fact that Mari could be the demon lord. That's just okay. Mm hmm Yeah. <laughs> so are we seeing both Mari and Tana today? Because then the only one we have to see is yo. That's pretty. Uh, Kotoko, I think that's how you say her name from Genshin. She would love this. You'll be fine. Mm. <laughs> mm. 
You keep going. She looks so pretty! The sea slug. <laughs> Mario, where's your girlfriend? Mm. Right? Right, yeah, yeah. Wait! Excuse me.
I know that outfit's very pretty. No! I feel like, for me, it's still... Because, see, okay, I'll say this. The All three of the third years, like, they're still number one for me. Mm hmm Yeah, I would say your friends. Really no, they kinda look more like macarons. Yeah. Yeah, they literally was like, Yeah, you get to see Mari today, but no cut on a yo. You gotta wait till next week. Okay. Because it does make me wonder. Because there, okay. With Mari being lonely, like, of course, when Kanan comes in, that's when Baby ain't gonna be lonely anymore because that's her girlfriend. So it does make you wonder when that necessarily is going to happen. So, like, at least, like, what, two, three weeks, maybe four weeks from now, um, everybody will interact. But, yeah, I truly love that we got to see so Ruby, well, technically we saw Ruby last week. Really just the newest one is Mari this week. But to have the Ruby, Daya, Chica, and Yohane interact together, like, yes, that's good. It makes me more excited to see all of them interact together again and me cry. Because Yo was the only one. Yo and Kanan, that's it. And then we got everybody. And then they just all got to be together. That's it. So just give me that. You gave me two out of three. Guilty kiss. <laughs> well, no, you gave me three for three because Mari was the only one who else I needed to see. That's it. Three for three. We did it. Congratulations. Now I just need to see them interact. Now, of course, it feels like maybe the more Johanna interacts with the rest of the girls, that's when she gets each girl's logo or emblem that represents them. Which is nice. It, it does make you wonder what the emblems for each girl is going to mean and signify. Which, of course, we know what they mean outside of it. It's their symbol of them. But for this, and especially for Yo Yohane to use her magic, what is that going to Could she not use the magic when she's only with those nine? I mean, well, eight, counting her, is nine. Um, or is there something more to it? It's still a lot of unanswered questions. But I feel for Mari in this because baby is, she. she's like, I'm alone. I have no one. She's on an island by herself. Yes, she has all these, like, cute little freaking pets because, yeah, what's her face from Genshin Impact would literally love staying there because it is very much underwater vibes. And I love that. Even though, um, what's her face? She, look at, what's her face from Genshin Impact who is freaking Umi in it, um, She's second best girl for me. Ayaka is number one. But still, I love them both as much because I'm still trying to get her. Because I got Ayaka, finally. And I just want her. And I think her rerun came about a while ago. But still, it would be nice. Hopefully, I could just start playing the game again and just, like, save my butt off. But, yeah, I think it was really sweet. I just, I feel for Mari in this. Like, baby is over here, like having Johanna look at her and she's like okay you're not afraid of me you you don't think my horns are ugly or I, I look different or out of place and my baby Johanna is just like no you're fine you look cool embrace that and, and you know I think that's the one thing that Johanna really does for everyone it's just like embrace what you have like heck I was not expecting Daya to you know be a badass samurai fighter today on a motorcycle. And Chica, with her giving me Tuxedo Mash, Charlie's Angels vibe, but I also loved it too. So, 
it's good. I love seeing the fact that these girls are more than we're getting more characteristics of them from you know the original Love Life Sunshine and such. I, I think that like this is damn good. Uh, I it's just mm, we need to know the mystery more around this town that these girls are living in. And so I think by episode five we'll probably get like a big behind backstory on it and the context clues that we are essentially missing. But I mean, yeah. But next week we get Yo and Kanan. So yeah. technically by next week the group is officially com complete and such. The song was good for a fight scene that was really good. So hopefully they release that song with um the Yohane solo song. And me and my friend, we are still praying that this show has a moment which each girl is doing a song, whether it is together or apart. But, you know. We have to wait and see. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode episode three, right? Yes. Episode three of Sunshine in the Mirror. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the match squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all on Sunday for episode four. Bye, guys.